Hi guys. It is just a nasty, nasty, gloomy, cold, rainy, yuck, depressing day here in the end times in Garfield, Texas. So I'm procrastinating once again to get back to my defensive driving course from hell here on this gloomy Wednesday morning. February 21st, 2018, I believe, and so uh, I got to get to my, well, try to scrape together a climate change meltdown roundup around here on this cold winter day, but before I do, I got a few other things to get off my chest, and before I even get in to Humpty Dumpty Tribe, I just wanted to uh, share an email I got from none other than my old friend Hillary Clinton. Hillary Clinton is uh, is emailing Hambone this morning, and uh, Hillary just has a request for Hambone. Hillary says, Hambone, I want to know what you think. Hillary Clinton is asking Hambone Littletail what he thinks today. I don't know, Hillary, I'm thinking the same thing I've thought since the day I ever first saw your ugly face splattered across wherever I saw it. I, I, I think you're a fucking bitch. I would actually use the C word for you. Uh, you're certainly a, a UUOP. If you don't know what a UUOP is, then... Uh, then, then obviously it's it's irrelevant whether or not you are a UUOP. Uh, I think that you're an evil, warmongering corporate whore. I think that you're both a a pawn of and an architect of at the same time the New World Order. Uh, my guess is that you're just a nasty, just, I mean personally, that you're just a nasty, controlling, self-centered, narcissistic, ultimate bitch. As our tribe's member, Judy Jewell, I noticed that you made the, um, the Bitch Hall of Fame. When, when Judy Jewell uh, went to look for what was it, the top five or six biggest bitches on the planet, your name was there. I think that you are a, a obviously a corporate whore. Uh, you are one of the biggest cheerleaders of fracking in the history of the planet. Uh, I, I think you're a little foundation that, that you and uh, your, your husband, your co-conspirator in crimes against humanity and the planet, uh, I, I don't even want to think uh, about uh, the shit that, that the Clinton Foundation is involved in. Uh, you are certainly a war criminal who needs to be tried, convicted, and if not hanged, at least thrown into life in prison from some sort of uh, war crimes tribunal. Uh, what else does Hambone think? Uh, I don't think you're the best looking woman in the world. Uh, no wonder Bill is you know, running around with, uh, with God knows how many uh, of these hookers, probably, the, 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 he's probably still, you know, he and Donald Trump passing off the, the, these damn hookers to each other. My guess is that you, are, that you probably hang out at the same country clubs that Donald Trump does. Speaking of Donald Trump, you are the number one reason that Donald Trump is in the White House. Although I, I do believe that uh, you did get more popular votes uh, if you had just fucking butted out instead of uh, doing whatever went down between you and Bernie Sanders. I will never know what really went down there. Uh, if the truth ever comes out about that, 
uh, but, but you are the reason uh, that Donald Trump is in the White House. And, you know, I've, as far as you and Donald comparing Donald Trump, uh, and, and, until Donald Trump came along, I might have said you're the single most despicable human being on the planet. But, but now, uh, with, with, it says everything is relative, you are not the most despicable human being on the planet, you are the second most despicable human on the planet. And again, as, uh, as I've said many times, the main difference between you and Donald Trump uh, is that you, just environmentally speaking, I'm look, looking at this through an eco-Nazi lens, if you had been elected president, you would have just continued the Farrakh Obama environmental legacy. Uh, and, and as Farrakh was, you would have continued to be what I call a, a bad sunburn, like a third degree sunburn uh, on the planet. But again, relative to Donald Trump, Donald Trump is like a nuclear bomb radiation fallout burn on the planet. Uh, so relative to Donald Trump, uh, you are, you, you, you know, you're, you're fucking Mother Teresa. But uh, relative to pretty much any other human on the planet other than Donald Trump, uh, you, you're the most despicable person on the planet. If Donald Trump had never been born, you would be the most despicable human being on the planet. Uh, what would I like to see, you, you know, you're asking me particularly, you know, what, Hambone, would you like to see Hillary Clinton do in, in the year 2018? I would like you to go away, is what I would like you to do. I would like you to fucking disappear. Uh, and, 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 and hopefully disappear into a solitary confinement prison cell for your various war crimes and crimes against the planet. But, but even if you don't go to prison, would you just go away? Would you go away? Uh, it, as long as you are on the scene, you and your little bitch friend Nancy Pelosi and, and, and the rest of these old fossils uh, the, the, you know, your staying on the scene in politics is, is, is as much as anything uh, doing more to keep Donald Trump uh, in the White House. You, you personally uh, are, are the most responsible person for putting Donald Trump in the White House. And as long as you won't shut the fuck up, bitch, and, and disappear, you are doing m more than any person on the planet to keep Donald Trump in, in the White House. Uh, you're a dried up, used up old fossil. You're not just a U-U-O-P, you're a U-U-O-F. You are a fossil. It is time for you to retire. I remember right after the election, you, you said something like you were going off for a walk in the woods. I think that's an excellent thing for you to do. I think you need to, to, I think you need to load up a big fucking fatty. Uh, you need to get about five grams of, of dried psilocybin mushrooms and a, and a bottle of good tequila and, and you and Billy Boy uh, need, need to hike off into the fucking sunset. Goodbye and good riddance. Garbage in, garbage out which I think Forrest Gump's advice to you would be, or his mother's. 
So anyway, is there anything else I need to add? Just, just fuck you, bitch. Fuck you. Uh, anyway, that's what I think. I hope this helps. And uh, goodbye, Hillary Clinton.